Hello viewers, welcome to another video on PowerMill tutorial 5-axis. Uh, so today we are going to cover one of the uh, topics which is available under tool axis page uh, for every tool path strategy. So uh, if you go to some of the tool path finishing strategies like constant Z finishing under the tool axis, uh, you can able to find mode actually. So this is what we are going to talk about actually. So in this strategy, you can able to find uh, three different uh, options for contact normal, vertical and power mill 2012 R2 actually. At the same time, if you go and pick uh, uh, profile uh, finishing strategies, okay. For example, under this one, you can able to find one more called preview frame normal actually. It is available under projection curve, projection line, projection point finishing strategies section. So this is what we are going to cover now, now actually. So the first one um, we are going to cover on um, contact normal. So this is a raster finishing strategy. In this one, as I said, uh, only available three. Uh, Power mill 2012 R2, I will cover later uh, part of this video actually. So it is having some uh, um, combination of uh, contact normal, vertical, and preview normal function actually for different tool parts. So first one is contact normal. So what is contact normal? So any point uh, if you uh, take in the tool path uh, over a surface, okay? So it will be always normal to the surface or we can say perpendicular to that surface area actually, that particular point. If you take here, it will be like this. So if you take from here, so it will be uh, fall in the other side actually. So always it will be normal to the surface actually. So from here, what you can do is you can add your lead angle or lean angle. So in this case, I given uh, 10 degree actually. So if you give a more degree from the contact normal or maybe not perpendicular to that particular point, then it will consider additional angle to tilt actually okay so that's what about here so for example uh, if you put zero zero if you calculate here with the contact normal all the area even if you select a flat area actually it will be perpendicular to that point actually okay so from here if you add some angle for example if you add uh, 20 degree angle here and if you calculate that one the same flat area, if you look at that, it will be tilted actually, okay, to that. So perpendicular or normal to the surface plus the lead lean angle you are giving here actually. So that is what about contact normal. The next one is vertical mode actually. The vertical mode is uh, nothing but uh, it act like, uh, act like, uh, VMC or we can say vertical machining center mode, that means a three axis mode, when you select this one with zero, zero actually. Zero, zero, even you selected lead lean, okay? If you select in the mode called vertical, then your tool path always is um, work like a three axis actually. Okay, so you can take any point, it will be uh, pointing towards the Z axis actually. It's always vertical. It's almost like three axis programming. But from here, if you tilt 20 degree, it always consider from the vertical plus the angle you are providing here. If you give 20 degree here, from vertical plus 20 degree actually. So from always calculate from the vertical actually. So if you select from here any point from vertical 20 degree. So previous case, contact normal or normal to the surface, uh, perpendicular to the surface, plus the angle we are providing. In this case, in the vertical, from vertical, it will tilt the, the degree we are providing. That is called vertical in the lead lean, actually. It will be applicable for different uh, tool axis also, the same way, actually. The final one is uh, preview mode, actually. Preview frame, you can say. Uh, the preview frame will not be available in a normal constants that are maybe in a raster finishing strategy. It will be mostly available in um, in this uh, projection and pattern finishing kind of strategies actually. So if you go and do the settings here, tool axis, you can see a preview frame actually. 
okay so what is meant by that actually so it's a, a simple strategy to call it about we know that it's a line projection there is an option called we have here it is preview so whatever the value we are giving like uh, the location of the line the location of the tool axis okay the direction of the tool axis if you preview it it will create a cylinder in the point projection uh, video we had seen a sphere in this case it's a cylinder you can see that it create a preview here it is going to create so for this preview frame it will be act as a perpendicular to that frame so contact normal is uh, perpendicular to the surface preview frame is perpendicular to this preview frame okay this preview frame can be changed in means of azimuth angle or elevation angle or in means of pattern actually you can say start angle and end angle you can give and you can tilt that so this is about three modes and the final one is uh, what we going to cover is uh, power mill 2012 r2 mode okay so what uh, i had told you earlier is this mode will work with different kind of strategies different kind of activity actually for example if you take constant set finishing and uh, raster finishing it will work like vertical plus angle we are providing if you take like projection line or projection point finishing it will work for differently so that will i will uh, show you an, in a, a presentation mode how it will work okay so this is about uh, different kind of modes uh, we will see what is the power mill 2020 mode uh, 2012 r2 mode in the presentation so as we had seen in the live example so i will conclude this with the different modes uh, the first one is contact normal okay so always normal or perpendicular to that particular area of the surface actually if you angle is lead lean as zero zero okay if you are uh, mode is vertical with lead lean as uh, zero zero it will work like a vertical uh, uh, vertical axis actually okay from there it will consider your lead angle and lean angle. Whereas in the contact normal mode, wherever the point uh, you are selecting, it is normal to the surface plus the lead and lean angle will get calculated actually. Okay. Then, as I said in the uh, uh, example, power mill 2012 R2. It is a combination of uh, or maybe it work with different tool path strategies with different mode actually okay so if you say embedded pattern it work like contact normal okay that means perpendicular or normal to the surface flow line contact normal uh, parametric spiral it work like an undercut angle actually pattern uh, finishing tool path it will if you using as a tool path of reference uh, it will use this uh, reference as a tool axis uh, profile finishing it will work as a contact normal uh, in projection line curve point and surface it will work like preview frame because the preview frame is available only in projection mode actually tool paths and surface finishing always also contact normal so these are the different types and we had seen the preview normal uh, one frame normal okay so what it is happening uh, the uh, frame we are whatever the preview frame we are creating in projection line point to that frame it will be act perpendicular okay so this is the four types of modes available under our uh, tool axis page thank you we will see you in the next video actually